If you want to mine Monero, the easiest community approved way of going about doing it would be with Goopax. And in this video, we're going to do just that. With Goopax, we can be mining Monero on P2 pool in a matter of minutes. We do not need to run a node or do anything in a terminal window. All it takes is a simple installation, a couple selections in the GUI application, and we are helping contribute to the mining network. Plus, the version we are downloading has a bonus raffle that you can play. So let's get to it. So we're going to be downloading Goopax with two X's. This is the version with the XMR versus Beast raffle included inside, which is optional to participate in. This is a maintained fork of Goopax with one X, uh, but you can also use that one if you so choose. Anyways, on the GitHub, you can find the downloads and what we're looking for is the bundle version for your operating system. The bundle version contains all the different programs used in Goopax. So download that onto whatever operating system that you are using. Uh, one important note, if you are using Windows, you will need to add the folder as an exception. So I have here a video showing what you need to do. Uh, I actually am shamelessly taking this from the Goopax tutorial video on their GitHub. But uh, yeah, if you have Windows, uh, this is what you want to do. Um, so you don't run into any issues uh, when you are running the application. Uh, you don't need to do this with Linux or Mac. So I have Goopax installed. So now I just have to make a couple uh, modifications and we can get this running. So I'm going to go to P2 pool first and I'm going to input my Monero address. Okay, so I got that here. And by the way, it has to start with a four. Uh, you cannot use a sub address. Okay. Next, we're going to find a node. Um, we can ping remote nodes or we can use whatever they recommend us. Um, we'll just use the one that they provide for us. And then we hit start. And so, yeah, now we have to just wait for it to get synced. So we'll just sit back and wait a few minutes. Okay, now we're all verified. And we know that because down here, this little green circle, well, now it's green before it was orange when it was syncing, but now we're fully synced. So uh, we can now go over to XM rig and put in the amount of threads that we want to use. Um, so, you know, depending on your CPU, you can put more or less threads. So yeah, I'll just bring this down to four and I'm just going to hit start. And I'm going to put my password in and there we go. I'm mining on P2 pool. It's that simple. And because of how Goopax is set up, you know, all we have to do basically is tell it how many threads we want, click a button and it automatically syncs to P2 pool and everything is now running together. And if you want to verify it, you can go over to uh, status. So over here, we can see the hash rate that we have right now, which is only a thousand, which is not that great. Um, but um, we're, uh, we're we are connected to P2 pool. So if you go to the uh, P2 pool website, they do have a uh, calculator that you can use. So we currently have 1100 as our hash rate so we can calculate. And we can see that our estimated daily reward is 0.000083 XMR. So, so not that great, but that is what we would get if we were to be mining. So basically the way P2Pool works is you are trying to find shares. And once you find a share, then the next block that is found on P2Pool, you get the proportion of the shares that you find to the block. And so, yeah, you're basically mining with a bunch of other people peer to peer, which is where it gets its name P2 pool. But what's cool is that there's no centralized host. So you're all kind of working together. There's no fee you have to pay. Um, so, yeah, it's just a really great way to contribute to the network. Now, the last thing we have here is XMR versus Beast, which is the raffle. And uh, what we're going to have to do is we're going to register. So um, we're going to go to the XMR versus Beast website which, uh, is here and we're going to go to register. We're going to put in our address and we're going to type the CAPTCHA and now we receive this token. So now we're going to plug in our token in XMR versus Beast 
And we're just gonna use a simple mode here just so I can show you how this works. We're gonna hit start. And that's pretty much it. We're now a part of XMR versus Beast. So the way this works is you contribute a certain portion of your hash rate to XMR versus Beast. And depending on how much you contribute, it will put you in a different tier. So for example, if you wanna qualify for the donor miner category, you would need at least one kilo hash per hour. And anyways, once you find a share in P2 pool, you are then eligible to win the raffle. And if you win the raffle, you get a hash rate boost. And with a hash rate boost, you'll therefore increase your odds of finding um, shares for P2 pool, and therefore you'll get more of a payout. So anyways, that's it guys. Um, Goop Hacks is just a super user-friendly way to mine. Um, and you don't need to download a node. Um, everything is built into the application. And seriously, within like five to 10 minutes, you'll be mining Monero and contributing to the network, but also contributing to P2 pool. And the reason this is important is because P2 pool is decentralized. And the future, fingers crossed, is that P2 pool will be the dominant mining pool. Uh, so far, it has not been the case. The adoption is actually very poor. So hopefully by making this video, I can help improve that adoption. So anyways, uh, thanks uh, for watching. If you like the content, I would appreciate a subscription. Uh, and that's it.